Hello, welcome to my video. <laughs> I have a new <laughs> I have a new light, sorry for laughing, but I really doesn't know how this works. I got a ring light in um, Christmas present and mm, yeah. We we're trying it this way today and then we'll see how it works. Um yeah, it's kind of dark in the room behind me, but if I light it up like this I think it's worse so I don't do that anyway that's not what this is about I am wrapping up the A to Z project pan um, beauty A to Z started by Jessica and Amanda uh, I have three more letters because I'm from Sweden and we have O, A and Ö here so I had 29 letters but for two of the letters I rolled in two so in total I had 31 products in this project and I have one more empty today and that means that I have five products that I don't finish didn't finish so I'm going to show you them in the order that they come in the alphabet and then we're talking about what to do with this product products, these products after this project and I'm sweating and I am much closer than I used to be so we will see how that works too. Okay, we have the first letter that I have left is E and for that I have the MIT Makeup Milesis 101 Active Eye Light Corrector and that is not a finished product uh, if I was going to finish it, I would have to use it as a foundation, but it's way too light and I have other foundations I want to work on, so I didn't do that. But it's it feels really light now. And we will see if you can see anything. Uh, it's kind of dirty and it's very white and it has silver writing on it, so you can't see much. But I used up... Mm, 0.44 grams since the last update and that's quite a lot I think. No it's not. It's kind of what I used to use up. In this project I have used up mm, six and a half gram. And this contains, I always forget how much this contains and it is very small writing. 12 milliliters. What did I say? 8. <clears throat> no, 6. But I had used it before, I think. And yeah, I don't know. I don't think it's 4 grams left, but grams and milliliters are not always comparable. So we will see. Like I said, it feels very light. Not very light, but kind of light. That's that. Then we have 4K and for K, we have the Coco Star eye patches from uh, Coco Star. <laughs> yep, that was it. Uh, these this beautiful shiny jar with eye patches. I think I used maybe one pair since the last update. I have this much left. The uh, yeah, it's pretty low, but I'm absolutely not finished with these. I didn't think I was going to and I don't want to rush. I could use them every day if I wanted to, but why? And this has gone down 3 grams since the last update. So I think one pair is kind of 3 grams or so. Who knows? Then we have... Ah, I forgot the <laughs> empty one. For G. That is the empty product, and that is the Stila Glittering Glow in Golden Eye, this one. And it looks the same. It looks like it's a line about here, maybe there, but that is just dry, um, dry product. Uh, the stopper is not out, but I have put in liquid before, and now it's just flaking, and I don't want to use it anymore. It feels very dry on the wand, It's I can see the bottom right through it, and it's done. And I'm happy about that. I have two more, 
and they are kind of tricky to use. Since the last update I used up 0.1 gram. Then we will turn the page and we have for L the Larizzi Glowy Dupot and if you remember this was not almost done, but it was not, not much left. I had product, it's this jar here, I had product on the outer rim of the, of the jar, but the bottom was clear and so on. But it was, a, it was um, too dark product for me to use as a highlighter. I only used it on my cheekbones, but in the summer it was okay, now it's not okay anymore. So, I got the <laughs> very good idea to mix it with another highlighter that I have in another project. And now it's very full again. It's not full, but... And this product is only like to here, so it's not that much product. But now it's the perfect shade. Um, and it's per the perfect consistency because um, in the other project I had a too light, oh, it's so windy, uh, too light uh, shade and it was kind of like stiff or hard to blend anyway. And now it's very soft and nice, so I'm pretty happy about that actually. Uh, I don't mind. The consistency is much better and the color is much better. And why not? So, that's that one. Then I have the sad, the saddest product in this project and that is the Too Faced Shadow Insurance Glitter Glue. This was, was the neglected uh, product for the whole year. I used it but not much. And I have used it once since the last update and used up 0.07 grams. But in total I only used up like 0.3 grams or something. <laughs> so I'm gonna save this. I may have said that I, I was going to throw this away but I used it the other week and it was still fine so I'm gonna save it and we will see what I am doing with that next year. And the last product is for A, the A with two dots on the top, the second to last um, letter in the Swedish alphabet and I picked the Lumina uh, Hydrating Aerating Gel Mask Lärte. Sorry about the pronunciation there, I don't speak Finnish. But I used this, I used 8 grams since the last update and I think I used it twice. But it's still a lot left. I thought I was going to be able to finish this, but then I kind of gave up because it's too much and I didn't want to rush this either. So, that means that I have used up a lot. <laughs> um, everything about... Uh, except for five products uh, in this project and that's that's pretty okay because I had 31 as I said products in this project so that's fine uh, this is going straight into another project this too so these are going uh, I want to finish them um, this one I'm not sure what to do with yet uh, but and this one I think it's going into another project too, or is it already in a project? <laughs> I don't remember. I think it is. Yes, it's in the project where I have the other highlighter, so of course it's in another project. And the concealer uh, is going into a project, but it's not. I'm not. I haven't thought it straight. I haven't thought it out yet. Is that what I'm saying? I don't know. That's it. It was the first time I did this project and I uh, liked it a lot. I'm going to do it next year too and I'm going to film the intro in about a little moment. So, thank you, Jessica and Amanda. This was fun and um, I like when it's like a lot of product, products but you don't roll in things all the time. It's nice to have those kind of products, projects too. Um, it's not that stressful. I like rolling pro projects too, but these are kind of nice. 
and it's fun to pick out products for the whole alphabet too. That's it. Have a nice day. Bye bye.